What's up, phone fam? It's your boy, Not Enough. I've said it plenty of times. Any opportunity you're on the road is an opportunity for blaster bargains hunting. Let's get it. All right, coming up on the first Goodwill in our route. This is a local one. This Batman Boomco thing, I don't know what it's called. Probably the Grappler or something, but never seen it before, but it's a Boomco and I'm interested in Boomco, so I grabbed it. But it was Blue Day. And Blue Day was half off. It was finally the right time for me to finally take one of these Nitro car launchers. Here we got an X-Shot Ninja Fury 4. Those are cool. Jaguar without the indexing clip. Got a deploy here. Pretty good shape. Not a big fan though, so I'll let the next person get it. Little sharp fire here without the little folding stock thingy that comes with it. Rapid fire. Some sharper image laser blasters under here. Uh, what do we got here? Some kind of a strike fire knockoff. Maverick in pretty good shape. Of course, we got the X-Shot Crusher. Always missing the chain. Vulcan in pretty good shape. Doesn't have the chain. Surge fire. I think it's the same one that I passed up last week because I already got two of them. Don't need more than that. Those are cool but i don't need any more this little pistol caught my interest i didn't see any name brand immediately on it but the light turned on everything worked cool dart storage i was like worst case scenario i can always get the spring for it it was tagged with the half off so i was like you know what i'll go ahead and take it so moving on to the next goodwill and whoa another perfect condition strife with the battery door these are no brainer guys but at 2.99 you just can't say no moving through the toys got some cool little rogue old busby vintage thing and and uh, I almost grabbed this dual strike because me and my girlfriend want to play the Wii game. But I already got the yellow one. I want to get the blue one, which is the N-Strike Elite version. So at least we have some variety. Then I'm checking out a Walmart here. And I can see that the Sentries are still going for five bucks. And then I saw Double Crusher for the exact cheapest price that I've seen them so far. So I was going to grab all two of them. And then I saw that there was only two. So I was like, yeah, I'm just going to take the one blaster. Put this one back for the next person who wants some Mega XL action in their life. Damn, that sounded terrible. All right, we got some more Spectrum here i think i just took one what's up y'all it's your boy not enough it is a beautiful saturday morning right now we're headed to walmart we're gonna go check it out let's get it all right guys coming up on the first walmart here and we we'll see some cosplay stuff battle blazers okay there they are the screamers i had to see how much they had i know it says 2766 on the package but they do ring up for 19. i grabbed a couple of those we see some rival end up getting three screamers one spectrum and one monolith real happy with that pickup now we're just gonna check out the rest of the goodwills are on the way let's get it all right coming up on the goodwill that's in route we can see some night finders some X-Shot Six Shooters, Ryan's World Six Shooter thing, Phantom Core Apollo, little Nano Fire. Ooh, a drum with no price, but down here in Florida, they'll just throw a price on it at the register. So I'll take you. Oh, and a crossbow to add to my girlfriend's Rebel collection. I am taking you. Diamondista crossbow too. I like it. Next Goodwill. Let's check it out. Busby Predator thing back there. Not really interested. Cool little roundhouse. I have two of them. Not really interested. Cool pistol for anyone that needs one. Uh, mega attachment. Cool. A are never have the mags if they did i'd probably think about it but uh don't have it so put that back and a rapid red without the mag i have a lonely mag at the house now it has a rapid red to be mated to so i was real happy about that and moving on what's up y'all it's your boy not enough and today is a beautiful sunday morning with me today is miss not enough gotta bring the good luck with you guys so we're gonna check it out and see if they got anything let's get it all right coming up on walmart on our sunny day and we immediately see some matrix fires again on clearance for 2098 that's a great price thunder shots for seven bucks flip shots for about 14 bucks still never going to be as cheap as target had them for six bucks roblox shark seeker i really wanted it i didn't end up taking it but later picked it up spoiler alert finally one rebel mech better than none but at least i got it we eventually ended up trying to go to some more walmart to see if they had any more but i'm happy i secured this one for sure so that was going to go in the cart then of course the nexus pro rows for 29 bucks more mega excel darts more matrix fires more trigger fires more battle blazers all on clearance moving on to the next walmart in line and we see monoliths on clearance this one had them not all walmarts have monoliths on clearance and strike elite jolt the original blue my favorite two dollars and fifty cents cheapest i've seen it and it was the last one so that was a sign i took it cool to see a rush 40 still on the shelf clearance this one had a roughed up box for 22 bucks went through an additional toy clearance area to see if there was anything special the legos were cool but moving on no trip goes unwasted we bargain hunting all the time let's get to it all right coming up on the first good one and what do i see a halo boom co pistol i don't know exactly what it's called but i know these are rare i know there's a red one and a blue one i was just happy to find one period it was not black day but a dollar 99 with the darts 
That means that I can unprime all my other ones. That's cool. Sun faded strong arm hiding in the back. And a rebel courage crossbow. That's always nice to find. No arrows. And it was definitely primed, but nothing a pocket knife can't make quick work out of. We got a generation one magnum super drum from Dart Zone. A barricade, my first one ever. I am so happy right now. It was in immaculate condition, like it was never even taken out of the box. $3.99, it was a steal. There was no way I was leaving that. Fortnite ARs, Villainator without the drum as usual. Nothing of much interest on the shelves, so I was definitely gonna take the crossbow and that barricade. On to the next Goodwill. Went ahead and grabbed this Optic QX4 since it was on sale this time. On to the next Walmart and see this Omega Royale. So these are actually on clearance, secret clearance actually. They'll have one price on the shelf, but then when you ring them up, they are $15. Let's get into some blaster bargain hunting. All right, guys, I had a tip that this Walmart had the last rough cuts in actual store stock. This is usually an online only item. 10 bucks each. These things, I can't find them for less than 60 on eBay. You know I had to grab them all. Checking out the clearance section in that same Walmart. Got some Conquest Pros. Nothing surprising or new. Then I turn around and I see this Speed. Box was a little bit mangled. They wanted 50 bucks for it, which was pretty good, but I don't need another Speed. I do recommend you guys check out my speed video that thing is an absolute beast of course we got the nitro car launcher tested the battery all good it's got its mag i just need to get some cars now mysterious pistol that i did pick up along with that nitro optic qx4 which i picked up towards the end of the video kind of cool got the batman grappler pistol thingy from boom go the rebel diamond d stuff crossbow this one shoots regular elite darts and it uses a string to propel them, similar to the Chewbacca crossbow, which is kind of cool. Nothing special there, just another addition to the Girlfriend's Rebel Collection. Another Rebel crossbow, this one shoots the arrow variety of projectiles. I really like the teal, baby blue kind of turquoise that they use. It's actually really cool. This one also uses a string to launch the projectiles, which I like it because it keeps it authentic crossbow style. There's way too many crossbows out there with magazines and regular elite darts. Nothing special from that, but these are pretty genuine. I I like them. Ended up getting the 20 round drum mag for 99 cents. The cashier was pretty nice. She was like, well, you look like you and your family are gonna have a fun Nerf war, so I'll hook you up. That was kind of nice to see. Of course, that rapid red that did not have a mag, I paired it up with the lonely mag that I had here at the house. So now I have another rapid red. I think that makes four in total. Got a special video coming out soon about one of these, so stay tuned. Boomco Halo pistol, which is pretty amazing. I like it. And it's the first time of me actually having any kind of Boomco darts really happy to have that who doesn't like a strife right man this thing is in perfect condition not a single scratch i'm so happy with this damn thing my very first barricade this thing is so damn cool revolving 10 shot cylinder on a little flywheeler i just love the creativity that nerf had back in the day that's kind of like a lost art nowadays i already got a regular crusher but can't deny that the gold is so cool on these things got a crazy rough cut deal now i did check if you guys are interested in these i don't know how long they're going to be available but they are online for the same price 9.99 you can only buy two max per person. So since I was at the store, I took advantage and I grabbed them all. Was able to land a Rebel Mech. I did get a second one. It's just not in the frame here, but I did finally get a second one. I had to get it to a couple more Walmarts to finally find it, but I'm really happy I found one of those. These things are cool. Curious to see what they would be like in modded condition. And then last but not least here, we have our Spectrum. I just wanted to put one in the frame, but I did get two of them. Guys, I appreciate you watching. Thank you for sharing, liking, subscribing, and I'll catch you on the next one.